Hey guys, Hellzone here. We're back. And today is the day we've been dreading. We're at Cinnabar Island. We did some off screen leveling to prepare for this. I left Bro where he was at level 50 and I leveled everyone up. Oh, you see a new, new team member, Bro Man? That's our Tangler. One more level, he learns a good move. Right now, he doesn't learn anything good. He's, not, he's actually the only pure grass type in Pokemon Red and Blue and Yellow. So, let's jump into this mansion and see if we can beat Blaine. Yes, I have a plan if over leveling doesn't work, but I'm hoping that that we can do it. Let's try. Wrong way. So, yeah. I'm debating if we just fight all the trainers in Blaine's gym so we can get their real good experience. Yes, we'll press it. But I don't have any. Here's the thing, I don't remember what to hold a fall through. Let's go this one. I hope that was the right one. This is the wrong one. It's like... Oh, well, I think that's actually the right one. Okay. We get Solar Beam here, and I'm not sure who we're going to teach it to. You know, it'll be good to have. Yeah, press the secret switch. I think we get solar beam here. We're gonna have to speed through this. So I set my Xbox One controller up with this instead of using what I was doing before on my computer. The rare candy. That's not what I was looking for. We don't have any escape ropes. I'm gonna have to. Magmar, we gotta run away. We don't have any. Ooh. Imagine if Blaine had a Magmar besides his Ponyta, Rabidash, Canine, and Growlithe. I think it's the Solar Beam. And this is the key card. I have no room for items. Can we toss? You know what? We'll toss this nugget. We might, we might have to do the missing boat witch. If we can, if we get stuck. This is the gym I've been worried about all along. And Arrival's Charizard too. Later in Elite Four, but we'll just start with this and see how that goes. Lance Lance's Dragonite shouldn't be too hard. Oh, they know Blizzard, which we're... I think one of them knows Blizzard, which we're actually weak against. Hooey. If I remember right, we can get out of here. This way. Oh! If you noticed the clip in the beginning of the video of me catching the Tangela with the Master Ball like I said I would. I didn't know what else to use it on, so I figured why not. Okay, I think we'll fight just the first, very first trainer. Let's see, nah, we're not gonna fight any trainers. We'll answer the questions because we're a Pokemon pro. All right. Can I pre evolve in Butterfree? Yes. Final evolution. Don't you love Pokemon? Okay. Pokemon quiz number two. There are nine gym badges. Yeah. Let's see. Probably will evolve well three times. Not in this generation. In later generations, he sure does. Dean. No. 
They didn't read that question. I just said no. Let's see. Yes. So, how can I have Spire Black? Which I'm big time worried about. Nope. Coming up to Rat Blaine. Let's see how this first try goes. So, a little body slam. Oh, good damn, good damage. So we might actually be able to take us get too excited, but so far, so good. And the paralysis? He's a super potion, I figured. Okay, two down. This is going a lot smoother than I thought it would, and I'm kind of shocked. Here's the real trouble right here. He's another super potion. He needs fire spin. Another super potion. Am I getting like the best plain AI possible, and this is going to be the smoothest fight in this whole entire run? I think this is what's happening. I'm not trying to get too excited, but Venusaur is putting in work against a fire team. Could just one shot us with foot. Fire Blast, that's what I was. Yep, right here. It should one shot us no matter what. Oh, it doesn't one shot, and I'm burned. Okay. Get the par paralysis. But does it help us out, is the question. He uses basic ember. Flame, what are you doing? Are you trying to give me this win right now? Another body slam. My brother burned. Another ember. This should KO us. Okay, so now we're in good we're, we're in good shape. Send out Arbrosif. We might be able to outspeed with Dig. Can Dig do big damage? That's the real question. We just beat Blaine with a team of Grass Pokemon. Wow, we got the best possible Blaine AI we could ask for. He didn't attack until his Arcanine came out. I don't even know what to say. I thought this fight would take multiple tries. We're not going to make room for Fire Blast because we don't need it. But I'm kind of shocked that that was that easy. <laughs> Our Parasite Brosif coming in again with Dig. I'm so glad I taught him Dig. So let's go heal up our Pokemon. So... Oh, I know what we can do real quick. We can use a Leaf Stone on our Execute, our Bromi. What? He's evolving? Into what? What could it be? An ex executor. Dang. Our team is looking real good for a team of grass Pokemon. Should we go take on Giovanni? Hmm. How about we demonstrate the missing go glitch? See if that works. Yeah, we can do that. Let's do, we're gonna deposit some Pokemon real quick. Roman. We got our Pidgey and our Lapras. So let's go to our Items. One, two, three, four, five, six. So now our red candies are in our sixth slot. So the way this glitch works is you go to Viridian City, talk to the old man, you let him teach you how to catch a Pokemon, then you fly back to Cinnabar and surf up and down the coast until Miss and Go appears. You kill it, and the sixth item in your slot will be glitched out. And I think it's like 255 you get out of that item. 
So let's let's demonstrate that real quick now that I explained it. So I know this will come in handy for grinding, so talk to it. In a hurry, you tell him no. We'll speed through this part of him teaching how to catch the Pokemon. He catches the Weedle. Boom. Fly back a Cinnabar. Now, don't go in this gym or any other building or it resets it and you have to do it over again. Other Pokemon will appear too, like Ponytas and... There you go. See Missing Go appears? Go to items. You can see Rare Candy say zero. That means they're glitched out. And that is essentially the Missing Go glitch and how you complete it. So if you enjoyed the video, drop a like. Don't forget to subscribe, leave a comment, and we'll see you in the next one. Next video, we're going to take on Giovanni and head up the Victory Road because we're in the home stretch.